Salem, 2014, The Vow, I, Isaac Walton, have gazed upon the nakedness of Abigail Cook and did kiss her, and did commit the sin of self-population pollution, and committed the sin of self-pollution. On this glorious day, our brave boys must have faced the devil's shock troops, French and Indian savage, mismassing the woods right outside our doors. What are they going... And what are you going off to defend? Not Sodom, but Sodom, Sodom. We expect nothing God to be on our side if we tolerate the abominations of those who commit them. You two remain in stocks overnight. You, boy, will bear the mark of your sins the rest of your life. No, please, please, for goodness sake, Silbury. The stocks and lashes are punishment enough. No, fornicator, judge not, lest thee be judged. He said that Jesus, you might have heard of him, John Arnold. My respect to your father's memory, though well, he can only shield you so long, it's a good thing you must ring out tonight. Like you're not so he's in charge. He tolerated your father, but he won't be happy till he sees you swing. Hey, didn't you learn anything today? Yes, if you spend your one more night under the same stars as that bastard George Silvey, I'll gut him like a pig that he is. If I'm not, if you're talking like that, we'll land you in the stocks. No, stay soon. I'd rather die fighting the French and Indians that get pissed on by the good souls of Salem. So you're really leaving? Mary, trust me, I will come back for you. Hey, look, this is all that I have. I swear on my father's grave. This is my vow the war will not last a year. Forward, stay in formation, gentlemen. Isn't that half a day's ride? I can't make it. I think I'm going to be sick again. Shh. As soon as you sit down inside, it will settle. Wait, you'll be- Wait, you're better, the girl. Peace be upon you and upon you. Peace be upon you and upon you. Those are things be set, to be said in war. Gives a certain kind of man some place to end others, ever. Then at the end of brand of a rope, you think me one day, stay strong, and t- after night we'll be, it will be over. Tippy a weight. I change my mind. I want to go back. No place for that child in Salem. Charles Stilbury drove John Arden off to die in the war. You think he's going to do to you when he finds out you're pregnant with John's baby? Do not fear the woods. The woods are going to take care of your little soul. And you, what is this? You want to live? Stay still, please. It's all I have left of him. Shh. Hush, not wait. I don't want to do this. You don't have a choice, Mary, please. This is what you want, please. This is what you want. No, please, let him in. No, please. Say here, John, John, help me. Help me, now tell him. Say it. This is what you want. Yes, yes. All the world shall be yours in return. All the world. The heaven and flaming fire. Making vengeance upon those who know not God. Disobey the gospel. Read for yourself the truth. Horrible, the terrible truth. Which is among us. The devil and Solom. You, for you, sir, for you, sir. No, easy. It's our house. Isn't uh, any ardent left. So you're either a ghost or you're about to be one. That's a harsh way to say, welcome home, Johnny. Can't be, I heard. You were dead, killed in a war. I wish I were had. Was a couple of times. Oh, well, you can't keep a good man down. So the three men strung up the way into town. A new gallows is being built on the heart of common. What the hell is that? Precious Sodom called up with a stinking witch panic. Witch panic? Where did a bigwig send in in to put out the fire in a mighty increased mouthful? No, his son Cotton, not a chip off the old block. Betty Splinter, I remember when he, when he had kids, he used to dress like a girl, fought like one too. Well, he's grown up now, fighting forward and fighting clothes. And not just a fool, the most dangerous kind of f- that thinks he knows everything. You don't, and you didn't come back for all this whole shit. You come back for one thing and one thing only. Told her, truth told, she's finer than ever. She's the richest woman, sell them. Why not? He's Mary Selby now. Selby? George Selby? Not his, his wife died a few years ago. She's done, been gone a long time, John. Keep your powder in your bag. One day you'll marry the richest widow in the country. A driver's at the door with some packages for you, madam. Send them in, Matthew Avenue. Take me, Samuel, with you. 
Tie him for his bath. Now is it? Tell me some news of the world. Saw a dusty fellow walking into town today. Can't believe my eyes. Why, John Arden? Welcome back, Robin Benavifter. Rama, going to hell. I need three strong men up and pay. Well, for what? To shoe girl? Reverend Lewis. Please help my daughter. And be careful. Take her down. Take her down. Please, I beg you, sir. Please make this stop. I can do nothing. Mercy. Let she tell me. Who is to wench if she's right here? There she. Who is there? Here. Mercy, you must tell me. Who is in this room with us? A hag, the old woman. She's only right there. Please. A simple psyche. Physic to sleep. Please, please. Could we call it a spiritual, spiritual attack? The work of witches. Pray for her. I call it bullshit. She's certainly touched in the head. She needs a doctor, not your prayers. Don't do the child. I want you in the front row with Court of Mather. Can't help be dazzled by your charms. For heaven's sake, mother. We're not we're just, just wrap me in silk. Pray me in the vulture block. Fear no man's war. For only war from hell. Destroy Solemn. The devil was never going to let, let a promised land be built. He without a fight, without a battle, in which his arm with daily menace, daily menace has most magnificent insidious weapons in their battle in that war. Ere even a single witch in Salem is enough to destroy everything we built and ever hoped to build here. Now we have already killed three of them, and yet their menace Continue unbated. Why? Because that still witch is among us. Perhaps in this very hall. Imagine a foe you can see armed with weapons, alone and ability to peer at any one of us. And then how can you possibly hope to identify the great culprit? Have you seen the girl, sir? No, even, even now, Mercy Lewis bleeds from the hundred pounds. Some possible, some possible to self inflict. See, she's the one who tells us who does this. I see the ravens of poor sick girl will help to identify your reason to fail to deliver. My father, yes, of course, your father. Did your father, whom we will respect, offer you any advice? We sent you in a steed to your aid. He the menaced advice, caution, caution. We take three people hung as a measure of Martin Kuduna's caution. It could be nothing worse than solemn for the country when a witch hunt, which is witches indeed. Beloved husband, head of a sectional man, reminds me there's something worse than a witch hunt. A witch, a witch, sure, it's bad. And not, why, why not oh, go goblin? Why not a drag as long as we're talking about fairy tales, John Arden? As well become welcome. Captain Arden home for his long, long service. Defence. Puritans know their sun is setting. Nothing was like a new enemy, or new enemy to get people behind you. Captain Arden, Miss Selby. Miss Selby, I'm hosting a small dinner tomorrow night. We'll be honoured if you join. Why are you staring at me? I don't even know you. Isaac, the fornicator. Hide your wives, hide your daughters. Hell, we just shall sheep. All right, look. So what do you want from me? Listen to me, John Arman. Going home to Salem to get out of the wars, the jumping in the ocean, to get out of the rain. Hive hurts. Hides, they could be, you could be in, they could be anyone. Or they who, who they? Witches, ain't no fairy tale, they're real. All these years, you're merry. Ones who've been, done me a good turn. She's not my Mary now. She left for about months before. Look what happened. Don't walk out on us again. Right within this three witches, familiar demons, using the form of an animal, cat, rat, a bird, a toad, they form all sorts of usual tasks as long as they're fed. She heard about what she told us. She was forced to feed their familiars. They must be searched, she must be searched for mouth teats where she suckled them. She must be marked, so it's for the marks. Teach us where she suckled them. Please help her. Well, to the inhabitants of the earth. As a seal. See, for the devil has come down to the great wrath. Because he knoweth that they have got a short time. Revelations 12, 12. I see the end of the world urges you into great efforts. Mmm, as it must be us all. Our girl, granny used to scare us silly with those witch toys. She really terrified my brothers. You told him witches could steal a man. Ah, would you, would you like Gloria without bother 
Right above her, the man attached. Not this man. My darling, see you next time, Governor. Just attending to the poor. Well, I doubt the poor. I doubt the poor in spirit. Uh, Captain Arden, right? I haven't seen you since we were children. I expect we see to see you at Harvard. Tries he run off to join the military uh, like servant. I wish you would have loved to spend your four years carrying angels off the, on the heads of my pins, my, uh, but there was a woman, petty. I owe everything to my in my, to my education. Do I think you about taught you everything about honey witches? No. My father burnt schools back in Essex. I read every book there was on the subject of innate languages. So you learned about your hunting for books. So that's what it's a bit like learning the facts of life from your maiden aunt. But never mind, you're here now. You're an expert on witches. So let me ask you, what do these awful witches want, huh? The same things we all want to country of their own. I'm wasting my time fighting mere Indians. Good night, Harvard. Time for your feeding. Yes, 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 somehow, get, help me, help me, yes, no, help me, help me, George, don't fight it. You know, it only hurts once. You look away everything, you took away everything I had, you were spare everything I loved. Can you imagine how good it feels to take everything you have, destroy all you built, your lair, your very soul, you're done. I would like to make a toast of your hostess, Mary Selby, who's shown us a true piety, a true beauty, you mount to the same worship. Indeed, beauty is the last miracle, loud and ugly, foreign world. Fallen world, magistrate hell, I am convinced and about your daughter's inner beauty, Reverend Martha. Perhaps you should just a tutor for her, a Harvard man like yourself. I believe this is so only so much you can learn from books. Experience is a true teacher. Don't you read Captain Norden? Well, that depends on your experience. You must have been fascinating with the, with the Indians. They're so mysterious and so natural, natural, unnatural, I say. Say you're less savages. I assure you, madam, the Indians do have souls, if any of us do. How about the witches? Do they have souls? Two, they do. They have needed them to the devil's, needed them to the devil's self in exchange for powers and all they desire. A contract indeed, and ironic as they believe, by law. A woman is not believed to enter a contract, but through the agency of her husband, Nathaniel. Yes, madam, not witches or women. What do you think, Captain Arden? I don't know. I think some times are just bigger than the leaf. I got on this Frenchman, a faithful woman. Things I believe in when I see one. I find it, I worry more about the French and the Indian tax than I do witches. What's your opinion, Captain Arden? Just how vulnerable we are, hmm? As you say, as you're right, Captain Arden. I think this rich food doesn't agree with me. Some fresh air might help. I told, told, told you you were killed. What was it? That was before or after you married, Sylvie. I remember, I remember being t- once uh, that the war wouldn't last a year. Told once of your one last year. It was up to me. I waited for you. War, years and years without word. Couldn't write, of course not. Too busy. Could save the country. Not but slackly. Captured the British men. Told the others not to take this away from me. I said the universe itself was made of out vows. Pregnant carries consequences. I know that it was just half a silver, silver coin. You had no sources of silver now. Mary come me, not now or tonight. Have money in the bank in New York is different there. And not a purity in sight. It's not too late. We'll be together anywhere. Anywhere but here. New York, yeah. Is that before or after you're captured? You walk out here one night. You'll come back years later. And you'll think that Mary come here. No, can't. It's impossible. He never let me. Now, now, Mrs. Selby. Even with no right to monopolize a guest in fascinating Captain Arden, of whom I have rare gifts of cigar, of tobacco, from Garnier, and some brandy. I'm afraid all this civilized eating and drinking has laid me out, Perfect Magistrate. You told me he was dead. It's not like counting sheep, honey. More like counting shadows. They didn't change a thing. When what children compared to all the lies about you? Stop your weeping, woman. A boy didn't deserve those tears. And not for him. Not for your girl I once was. A girl belongs to someone else now. What is left of you to the wolf? Was it he that, 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 was it he that left you to the wolf's no child? It was he that saved you from the wolves and raised you up to do all this. Your grand vision, you lose sight of it. Don't lose sight of it. Tomorrow the moon is with us. Tomorrow begins. Leave your anger, your pain for the Vukratamina to feed on. Has he not been true to his vow? Had not your enemies now your slaves? Do you not have anything? Have you everything you desire? Wealth, power, almost everything. Pardon me, madam. A gentleman see you, Miss Crowley.
Corny, to uh, what do I owe your pleasure? I was wondering if I might talk to you, madam. I uh, had a small farm. First it broke my heart, and it broke my back. Now I know, I know, know and you and I know both. The heart heals, the heart never does. I took my trapping. I was mere is a meagre living, ruined at, ruined the Indians, but now it's ruining me. Thing about trapping is get, getting your good catch at night. To go trapping is meagre living, ruined the Indians, now it's ruining mine. Thing about trapping is you get your good catch at night, but by morning is someone else's meal. And me, I stay with my traps, fascinating Mr. Crowley. But that's why I was here, the night you did it. You and the Corinthian and girl, you waited a long time. Nobody's business like to know the testament. Till now, that was John Arden's baby you buried out there. The way he feels about you, you're right to know. Are you going to tell him? I saw all oh my blast his wretched thing, not too bad. Reverend Lewis says drawing is literary, like watching nature or something. Well, I just worse, might be worse than to worship. I'd like to draw you something. I'm not sure I'd like to see your a portrait of me. Besides, I've no time to sit. I am on my way down to town so soon, afraid of witches, being taken for one. It's a long way to New York. Good day. Oh, I don't mean to frighten you. I'm not frightened, just a surprise. It's of course a brill, brave enough to stretch in a graveyard. I don't, I'm not afraid of dead. Not living, though, that matter. It's because you know, know nothing of death. And less of life, I can teach you about life, a death and many things in between. You know what killed nearly every woman, Blarity, in love? No, mostly but bird and but died in, most died in childbirth. So love is a woman that war is a man, most deadly thing they do. So love to woman, that war is to man, most deadly thing they do. Only fools run quickerly to love or more than love. You best both watch yourself. Thanks, Mrs. Selby. I can inspire to your happy wisdom. Where do the witches meet? In the woods, and how many? I don't know. Who are they? I didn't see their faces. But they are their heads of all animals, like a stag or a pig or a wolf. Um, but you know who they are? Yes, yes, their names. Why won't you tell me their names? You won't let me. She... Yes. Who? Who's she? Tell me. I can't. Tell me the name, my God. Mercy. She cannot speak. She cannot speak a name. She'll show us a witch. Ah, oh, not sorry, Captain. You don't leave Salem just yet. Something is not, you've got to see. It's him, the witch. I think so. All I say is the victim doesn't, never mind your books. Is that the witch? He didn't plead either way. Is that so? Wouldn't dig a five vac segregation. Call the girl split bit of an execration? Well do you have to say? I say to Captain Arden, I find me Captain Arden and a You find me Captain Arden, I have plenty to say. I sent men from Captain Arden. But I told he left town. You just may obtain a plea. You've been named silent. You have been granted power. Use it. Press him for an answer. Let the same devil that beholds your tongue hold the stones, so hurry. Tell us about to begin. One, two, three, four, raise the devil to your door. Call the pig, wolf and the ram. Come to circle all that can can. Make him walk on the floor to the roof. Drink to him the horn and hoof. One, two, three, four, the devil's here. Now sleep no more, and the world shall be yours in return. Which is me here? They have got the better night eyes than do I. No, it doesn't need eye, night eyes. The night is their eyes. What the hell is all this? What the hell is this? Guess the devil himself and the young born. Cornea conceptia. Manification patriania. Wolf science and snack. Cummins and Eston. Now it begins, the circle is broken. By whom? Satan. Please, sir, I don't want to do this. Then don't. The original man had the power to press you for an answer. So you have to do is say the word guilty or not guilty. We can stop all this. If I say guilty, you'll hang me before dawn. If I say not, my fate is still in the hands of the rude bastards. Now I hold my peace and I trust in the Lord. Load of stones, I ask you again. Are you guilty? No, not. We are dead. No, we are not.
Good as I thought you'd seen him before. You wanted me to see him, and I saw them. You, they saw him. I told you they could be anybody. Okay, just calm down. Have you something to say? More stone, Charles. Get the hell off of him. Arden, he's dead. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and the sea. For the devil has come down unto you, unto you, son of a bitch. Son of a, uh, no, no, get my father's boots. The very first is Sodom. He warning every goddamn of you, you murdering, hypocritical, perjuring bastards. And these boots will be the last, I will. Be the last, I will ask you again. Who was there? Who saw us? I tell you again, I do not know. It's difficult to see a pass of merciful flesh. Yes, yeah, yes, you find out, Mr. Hale. Thanks for no turning back. The vanish hunt has begun. And he'll be turning, run, and we'll be running in trials. You understand that, don't you, George? You best of all. We use the trials to turn the Puritans against each other. They will hunt and kill down and drown in their own blood. There's no Puritans left standing, and Sodom is ours.